Hey everyone, I want you to take a look at this because I want to show you how I've been making money with affiliate marketing and earning anything from $300 to $500 a week with a system that only takes me around 10 minutes a day, if that, and some days I don't need to do anything. And I'm going to reload my page over here to show you that this is 100% legit. Like today I haven't made anything, but a couple of days ago I made $21 and $65 and there's been days where I've made as much as $182 and even $222 with this strategy. And the best part about this is I'm going to show you how to use Google Forms to do this. And all you need to do is create a very simple basic page like this, which I'm going to show you how to do on this video. And then from there, I'm going to show you how to get traffic from a website that gets hundreds of millions of visitors every single month. And on top of that, the main countries are T1 countries like the United States, United Kingdom, Canada, Australia, and even India, countries where people are interested in making money online, which means you can make some really good money on the back of this. And what happens with these Google Forms is you're going to be collecting people's email addresses and you're going to be promoting several products. This is a super simple way to make money with affiliate marketing. You don't need a website, you don't need a following, you don't need to be on social media, and I'm gonna show you everything step by step. Let's get into it. Now, just before we get into this strategy, if this is the first time you've come to my channel, make sure that you hit that subscribe button, turn on that notification bell so you get notified every time I post a brand new video. And if you haven't entered yet, my $500 October giveaway, it ends in a few hours where I will be giving five lucky people $100 each. So make sure you go down the bottom, click on the link in the description and sign up to that giveaway. All I ask that you do is that you smash that like button in appreciation. Let's get this video to a thousand likes and I'll do even more giveaways going into the next month. So the first thing that you want to do with this strategy is that you want to come over to Google and you want to type in Google Forms. From there, you want to scroll down and you want to click onto this one over here, which says Google Forms sign in. That's going to bring you over to a page that looks like this. Now, as you can see, once you're on Google Forms, you can create a simple blank form and they've also got all these other templates that you can use. Quite simply, all I do is click on to start a new form. Once you do that, it's going to bring you over to a page that looks like this. And this is where we are going to create this form. This is going to attract people. People love completing different types of surveys and forms, etc. And what we're going to be doing is we're going to be vetting people so that we know the best product to send them, which is going to increase our conversions and help us make money with affiliate marketing. That's number one. Number two, this form allows you to collect emails. And I'm going to show you how to automate that process so that you can do this very, very quickly and you don't have to spend a lot of your own time. So quite simply, when you're creating this form, let's say you're doing it in the affiliate marketing niche or the make money online niche, because that's what I do. And that's where I create all these forms. But you can do this, for example, with weight loss, relationships, a whole heap of different types of categories as well. So let's say you wanted to come over here and you wanted to call this something like affiliate marketing training. As an example, I just want to show you how to create this. So you come over here and you type in affiliate marketing training, and I'm going to show you a completed one as well. Okay. So affiliate marketing training, and then this is where you would start to create these questions. So you'd come over here and you would click onto question one, and you might want to ask someone something like <clears throat> how long they've been doing affiliate marketing. So how long have you been an affiliate marketer? Okay. And I'm going to show you and explain to you why all this is relevant. Now, as you can see here on the right hand side of here, you've got a few options as to how they can answer these questions. So if you click onto multiple choice over here, you've got check boxes and all I need to do is select that. They've got a drop down box so they would click onto this and it would be a whole heap of different answers that would come up. The one that I like to use guys is just multiple choice. And then over here, you can type in something like, for example, zero to six months. Um, then you can come over here and put six to 12 months as an example. Okay. And then you can do one year plus. Okay. So I just want to show you this very quickly. So one year plus. All right. Okay. So that is the first sort of question that you want to put up. Then from here, you can see you've got this plus sign and then you would click onto that. Then you would start your next question. Now I want to show you something up here in the settings section. So these are the responses and these are your settings. 
Every time somebody replies back to you, you are going to get an email letting you know that somebody has replied and that you have got their email address. So this is the responses. Obviously, I've got zero responses here because we just set this up. But then you've got settings over here. Now, very, very important that before you do anything is that you come over to settings, you scroll all the way down to the bottom and see these form defaults. You want to click onto this little drop down box and you want to make sure that you collect emails, addresses by default. You want to make sure that that's selected. And the second one over here, question default, you want to make sure that make questions required by default. So people say so you're going to be asking questions. You want to make sure that these two are done. You don't need to worry about anything else. Then you want to come back to questions and you want to complete this. And when you complete this, it's going to look something like this. So here's one of mine that I've just set up. It says best way to make money online. And then over here, I've got, do you want to make money with affiliate marketing? Yes or no? So they do. Yes, that's great. The second question is how long um, have you been working online? So you want to know their experience level so you know what product to send them. So if they're a beginner or if they've been doing this for you know three years plus and you can send them something that's a little bit more expensive, a little bit more advanced. Then you come over here and he says, how much are you currently making per month? They'll tell you how much they're making. Gives you a rough idea whether or not you should send them something that's you know, a little bit more expensive on a little bit on the cheaper side. And then how much would you like to earn per month? And then the last question, which is one of the most important ones, is you want to have something like how much are you prepared to pay to earn your desired amount per month? If they say $100 and you want to send them a product that's within that range, 300, 500, and then some people might even tick this. As long as it's guaranteed to help them make money, they may be willing to spend a thousand dollars. So they're going to complete all this. They're going to tick all this, and then you're going to get a response. So how are you going to get this in front of them? Well, the first thing that you need to do is you need to get this link. You want to get the link for this. And in order to get the link, you can see here that when you click on to send up here, once you click on to send, you've got these three options. And the first option is via email. So you can email this to people. If if you wanted to. That's not what I recommend that you do. The second option is this link. We're going to grab this link. And the third one, you can actually embed this on a website. If you've got your own website, you can actually embed this in there. But what we're going to do is we're going to use this link. And most importantly, you want to come over here and you want to click on to shorten URL. So this is the URL that we're going to be using. And then you want to copy this. So let me show you what this looks like. So I'm just going to open up a brand new incognito window. Okay. We're going to paste this in here. And once we paste this and we hit enter, this is what people are going to see once they click onto this link that you're going to give them. So you can see they're going to grab all this. They're going to hit submit. Most importantly, they need to enter in their email address in there. Then they need to scroll down and complete all this. Now, what we want to do is we want to get this in front of people. And the way we're going to get this in front of people is we're going to use Quora, but we're not going to use Quora the way I've showed you how to do it before. This is a little bit different and it's going to allow you to get followers on Quora. Okay. It's like setting up your own group on Quora and you can ask questions and you can also put up posts. And basically what it means is coming over to Quora and clicking on this section over here where it's got spaces. And once you click onto that, what this is going to allow you to do is as you can see, I've got all these spaces on here, but basically you can click on to see all spaces. And once you click on to see all spaces, you can create your own space. So you can see here, you can click on to create a space and space on Quora is basically like creating your own group. And Quora can promote these groups, number one and number two. You can also make money from the content that you put up on Quora as well, because they're running ads on these different types of spaces. Let me show you exactly what that looks like. If I click onto one of my spaces over here, like this one over here, make money online. If I click onto this, it's going to bring me over to this page. I only recently created this one. And if you scroll down, there's a few things that you need to do once you come up with your own space. So to, what I mean by that is if you come over and click on to create a space, you need to come up with your name and a brief description and then click on to create. Once that's done, it's going to bring you over to a page that looks like this. Now you've got a few options. Number one is you can create your own banner over here and you can change this image to show you one of my completed ones. This is one of my completed ones. I've just changed this image and I've created this banner on Canva and you can do the exact same thing. Then from there, what's going to happen is you can see here that's edit your visuals and space. So that's one the first thing that you can do. The next thing that you need to do is you can see he says add your first piece of content and that's what we're going to do.
But before you add your first, first piece of content, there's something really important that you need to do. So you can see it's going to say create post. You can click onto that. Now you can add a question or you can create a post and we're going to come back to that. The second thing that is going to ask you is view suggestions. Once you click onto this, you're going to see here that you've got submissions and suggestions and under suggestions, you've got this add topics. This is really important. You need to add at least three topics in here. So once you come over and you click on to add topics, the first one I'm going to put is affiliate marketing. And this is going to tell Cora where to promote your spaces. If you don't do this, you're not going to get a lot of followers. So the first thing you want to put is affiliate marketing. The second one you can do is something like make money online. OK, so you've got make money online and then the third one, you can do something like online business. OK, so you can do that online business. You can do that and you can even add another one and put in something like entrepreneur and type in entrepreneur and it's going to come up entrepreneurship, social entrepreneurship, young entre or just entrepreneurs. You can select a, a few of them. Let's just go with this one and then click on to done. Now that we have that in there, it can also give us suggestions on places where we can answer questions, potentially also create very similar types of posts as well. So you can see it gives us a whole heap of suggestions. So we can close that off. Now we've got that in there. Down here, you can also invite people to your space. If you know anyone that you want to invite or you can see somebody else has a bigger space, you can also invite them and you can also share your space on feed. So if you click on this, it says post the link about your space. People who follow you will see the link in your feed. So you can come over here and complete that as well. But you can do that a little bit later. What we want to do now is we want to create a post. I'm going to show you how to do this without doing any of the work yourself. Now, if you're following up until this point, I want you to do a couple of things for me. Number one is please smash that like button in appreciation. Number two, don't forget to also have my free affiliate marketing guide that you can get. It's in the link in the description. It teaches you different ways that I make money online with affiliate marketing. It's yours absolutely free. It's a booklet that you can download and keep. Just click onto that link in my description. It's yours absolutely free to keep. So make sure you do that after you smash that like button. And also let me know in the comments that you got to this point and that you're understanding me and give me any feedback that you need so I can help you follow along a little bit easier. So from here, what we need to do, guys, is we want to come over here and we want to click on to create post. Then you've got two options under the create post. You can see here, you can put that and you can just put this post in and then people are going to see it that are interested in affiliate marketing, online business, make money online, etc. Or you can ask a question as well. Both are really, really good. What we're going to do today is we're going to create a post. Now, in order to create a post, we need to find an article or something where we can do this. So what you want to do from here is you want to come over to Google and you want to type in something like free articles to use. And then from there, just click onto this first one that comes up. It's under Article Factory. Once you click onto that, it's going to bring you over to a page that looks like this. Now, this site has a whole heap of articles that you are allowed to use and share. You can see it literally says here, Article Factory allows writers and marketers to submit copyright free articles on a mixture of topics which can be distributed with no charge on websites. Okay, so you can actually reuse all these articles. So that's why you want to come over here and you can see you can search for a whole range of different types of articles. What you want to do is come up to the top over here and you want to search for affiliate marketing and you want to click onto this search icon. Once you do that, it's going to bring you over to a page that looks like this and you're going to be able to see all these different types of articles that are going to come up that are related to affiliate marketing. You can do this under online business, make money on online, etc., e-com or any other niche that you are creating this work on. Then you want to scroll down and find an article that you want to use. And I found this one over here. It's called is, Aff is affiliate marketing right for you? OK, then what you want to do is click on to this, open this article and that's going to bring you over to a page that looks like this. And this is this article so we can use this entire article. Now, before I put this up onto Quora, what I like to do is I like to come over to Google Docs. OK, so I want to sign into Google Docs and then I open up a blank sheet and I copy that entire article inside this Google Sheets document. OK, and I double check for any spelling mistakes and I just like to do it because sometimes a lot of these articles may have pictures in them like this. So I just like to copy it, put it into here. Once I put it into here, then all I need to do is double click onto this. OK, highlight everything by pressing Command A or Control A. I copy all this from there. 
I come straight back over to this site and I'm going to create this post. And then all I need to do is hit control paste. Now, once I paste this in here, you can see that everything is bald over here. Okay. So what I'm going to do is again, I'm going to highlight everything, everything. Okay. So command a, now you can see here that you've got this section over here where you've got these big a little a, you can just click onto that. And then I'm just going to click onto bald and I'm going to remove that from all being bald because what I'm going to do now is I'm going to put a call to action in this article for people to click on to that very, very simple survey that they're going to take so I know what products I can promote to them. So what you want to do from here, quite simply, as you scroll down, you can see here that you've got these paragraphs and then you've also got titles. Now with the titles, if you wanted to make them bold, you could, you could just highlight it and then click on to bold or what you can do is just make them, you know, titles like this. It's up to you. You can go through and make this stand out a little bit more. And then from there, what you want to do guys, see here it says, but is affiliate marketing right for you? What you can do is you can come over here and you can add a call to action. Quite simply, what you want to do is just type something in like this. Okay. So it says here, take this quick quiz. Okay. So just fix up any spelling it takes to learn what the best affiliate training is for you based on your experience. So all you need to do guys is come over here. You want to highlight this, you know, bold that you can make it italic. And what we're going to do is we're going to link this. Okay. So we need to come back to our Google, Google forms over here that we have created. And we're going to copy that link. Okay, then we're going to come straight back over to, to this Quora um, note that we're putting in here. We've highlighted that. Now we want to click onto this link and we want to paste that in there. Okay, and then you want to click on to add. You can see here now that this has a link in it. Once people click onto this, they're going to take that. We're going to get a response in our email address and we're going to get that email address. Then what we're going to do is we're going to reply back to them with the best offer available to them. Now, what you want to do once you come through now, I recommend that you copy this or you complete this a few times within this. Then once you're happy with what you have over here, guys, you can also add a few photos and images if you want to. It's completely up to you. But once you're happy with what you have here, then all you need to do is scroll down and click on to post. Once you click on to post, you can see here. So that's all done now. You can see it's going to say invite followers, etc. If you want to, you don't need to do any of that. You can just close this. You can see here that this has now been put up on to Quora. Okay. And you can see here that that link is in there. It has not been removed. If I click onto this, it's going to bring me straight over to that page. If I scroll down, I can complete this. And then once this is all done, I'm going to be able to collect these responses and email these people back. So from here, what do you need to do? Well, there's a few things. Number one is you need to find the right affiliate product that we are going to send to this person once we get that response. And also, if you want to automate this, what software are you going to use absolutely for free? And I'm going to show you that right now. So to find affiliate marketing products, you can come over to platforms like clickbank.com and even Digistore24 and you want to sign up. Once you sign up, that's going to bring you over to a page that looks like this. Just go over to their marketplace. Then what you want to do is you want to scroll down and what you're going to find is you're going to find categories like business and investing. You're also going to find things like e-business and e-marketing. You want to click onto that. Once you click onto that, you can see here that if you're doing something, for example, like make money online, you can see here you've got get paid to use Facebook, Twitter and YouTube. You can make as much as $29.80 for this one particular sale. Then when you scroll down, you can find other products like paid online writing jobs. You can make as much as $108. Then it gets a lot more expensive. You can make thousands of dollars promoting different types of products. As you can see here, you've got Scribble as well. It's another really good product. The other thing that you can do, guys, if you scroll up to the top is you've got these results, sort results by, and you can choose Gravity. These are products that are converting really, really well, and a lot of affiliates are making sales with these products. All you now need to do is find products that you want to promote. Let's say you wanted to promote this one over here, which can make you as much as $533 on average for one sale. This is a rebilling product. So when somebody signs up, each customer is worth as much as $533. So you only need one to make really good money online. So all you need to do now is click on to promote and generate that hop link. And then all you need to do is copy this link over here. Once you have a product that you're happy to promote, now what you need to do is use one of two things. Number one is you can use your own email 
to reply back to these people or generate or create your own email. Don't recommend that you do that, but you can do that. What I recommend that you do is that you use a software like this one over here called convertkit.com. It's an online email marketing tool where you can send out broadcasts and also you can import your emails and you can send them multiple products and you can also send out broadcasts, which means you can send the one email out to hundreds and thousands of people. So what you wanna do is you wanna create an account on ConvertKit. The best thing about ConvertKit is if you click onto their pricing, if it brings you over here, you can see that you can start this for $0 a month up to your first 1,000 subscribers. I've got a link in my description for you. You can sign up absolutely for free, okay guys? Once you have over 1,000 subscribers, it is going to cost you, but those 1,000 subscribers are going to be bringing you money in every single month because if they don't buy the first product that you promote, then you can promote a second and third and fourth product and you can literally send them an email out every single week with a brand new product and you're going to continue to grow that list by continuously putting up different types of articles on Quora and getting even more signups to these different types of quizzes. So this is why I absolutely love ConvertKit. Now, once you have set up your ConvertKit, this is where you would go to add your subscribers. Okay, so you'd come over here, you'd click on to add subscribers, and then you can start to add these single subscribers or you can import a CSV file, which is a spreadsheet file, where you can just import everyone where you've received a response from. And as you can see for myself, I'm just grayed out all these people, but I'm getting people signing up to my convert kit constantly. And then what I do is I send out these different types of broadcasts. So quite simply, I come up to the top, I go to send, I click onto broadcast. And then from here, I send out multiple emails and broadcasts to everybody that's on my convert kit email list, promoting different types of products, my YouTube, social media, whatever I want. And people are clicking onto these links all the time and I'm making sales. This is one of the best ways to make money online with affiliate marketing. Number one, promoting the right product, finding out what your customer wants, and then sending out these email broadcasts and promoting multiple products and growing your email list. So that's how you're going to make passive income, guys, utilizing affiliate marketing and absolutely for free without actually having a following to start. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to smash that like button in appreciation, but don't go anywhere. I recently made this video where you can convert articles into videos to make money with affiliate marketing. If you haven't seen it, highly recommend that you check this out. I'll see you on this video. Until next time, you guys take care of yourselves and goodbye.